into the boundary fence. The new world record holder is Brian Charles Lara of Trinidad and Tobago. What a moment for Trinidad and Tobago and West Indies cricket. Not this type of situation that I would welcome at all. It's great to think of the fact that he might be breaking the world record and most people would say to themselves I'd love to break a world record at some stage in anything but he must be going through a great deal of different sorts of emotions at the moment anxious to get to that 366 but at the same time telling himself he can't afford to make a mistake so close and yet so far He's called Chanderpool through this time. And he goes on his way, 3.59, Brian Lara. Must be a huge sigh of relief every time he gets to the non-striker's end so he can compose himself again. Brian Lara will be on strike. One of the most remarkable things about this innings, Michael, is that, that it's been chance, as he hasn't given one semblance of a chance really absolutely chanceless he has made a couple of mistakes very difficult for you to bat for 525 balls and not make a mistake but absolutely chanceless seven to get more runs here at least one but lewis is probably england's best fielder and he makes a direct hit with the throw so I think that would have given at least 10,000 people a heart attack if he'd gone for the second run. Brian Lara, 360 not out. Within touching distance of this world record. They must be mixed emotions for Sobers. And mounting tension for Brian Lara. cover drive through for four three hundred and sixty five he's equal Gary Sobers three hundred and sixty five not out Brian Lara he's past Leonard Hutton Hutton made 364 at the Oval in 1938 against Australia He's gone past that now, and he's level on equal standing with Gary Sobers. Lewis to Chanderpaul. That'll be the single that they've been waiting for. Chanderpaul moves on to 70. There are four balls left in Lewis's over. Now, what sort of field is Michael Atherton going to set? Brian Lara from Trinidad and Tobago and the West Indies is facing Chris Lewis on 365 not out. Atherton's got men in, saving the single all round the ground. Atherton's piling the pressure on Lara, making him wait. He wants his fielders in the right position. Nothing in this game of cricket comes easy, nor should it. He's not going to give him this run. Sobers waits on the boundary edge. His nerves jangling as well. The field is set. Everybody but third man and long leg is saving the single. Here comes Chris Lewis to Brian Lara. He's gone for the pearl, and there it is. Done it, the ball rockets into the boundary fence. The new world record holder is Brian Charles Lara of Trinidad and Tobago. What a moment for Trinidad and Tobago and West Indies cricket. Tony Cozier. What a moment indeed. And these scenes will be repeated all over the Caribbean. Wherever people are, they're jumping, they're joyous, they're jubilant. And here comes the man whose record has just been broken. Sir Gary Sobers there, waiting for the jubilant crowd 
to disperse from around and engulfed Brian Lara. This certainly has been an excellent innings by Brian Lara. There are not too many superlatives that you can use at this stage. But as I said earlier on, if I had the balls in my hand, I would certainly be bowling a bouncer. Chris Lewis tried the bouncer. And Brian Lara dispatched it so easily in front of Square. But there are so many people around Brian Lara at the moment. Sir Garfield Sobers trying to get his congratulations in. But at the moment, unable to get to him. Look at that. I think a lot of those policemen out there are just happy to be so close to Brian Lara. Not too interested in getting the crowd off the field, but enjoying the moment themselves. Absolutely brilliant. Well, Gary Sobers set his record on March the 1st. 1958, and today at 11.46, Brian Lara has passed that record. What a moment for him. What a moment for West Indies cricket. A great moment for Brian Lara. A marvellous moment for Gary Sobers to be here to witness it. Still in the best of health. Lara, 369 not out. 11.46 a.m. 18th of April 1994 we've seen history made today he kisses the turf he kisses the wicket the world record broken by Brian Charles Lara he's 369 not out the 369 runs came in 749 minutes of 529 balls and he hit 44 boundary fours. Brian Charles Lara is the new world record holder. He's the newest holder of the highest individual innings total in Test match cricket. Thank you, Charles. There can be no greater testimonial for a batsman than from Sir Gary Sobers and how beautifully he expressed himself at this marvellous moment for Brian Lara. 300 and 69 not out and that's how he did it how many times will that be shown on television screens around the world what a moment we've all been privileged here to witness it live at the st john's recreation ground in antigua and you television viewers have had a treat as well a moment of history for brian lara That's straight down the ground, four more. He's putting some daylight between himself and Sobers and Hutton. 374. Well, as far as Lara is concerned, this 366 mark came up perfectly. I think all plans were centered around Brian Lara getting the 366 runs. And the plan was if he got there pretty early where the West Indies could have a half an hour to 20 minutes of bowling at England they would certainly declare immediately but once he got there within 25 20 minutes of the luncheon interval they would back through until lunch because with the 10 minutes break between innings there would not be too much point in the clearing and it came up perfectly for him so that he can push this world record on towards the 370 380 mark Lewis has gone for the short one. Lara takes a single. He's on 375. The West Indies are 593 for four. Five ninety-three for four. Brian Lara on three hundred and seventy-five prepares to face the last over before lunch. Andrew Caddick is the bowler.
Well, if the English batsmen needed any encouragement as far as batting on this pitch is concerned, they have seen it from Lara. But look at this liver from Chris Lewis. A bouncer. Lara had all the time in the world. Bounced pretty high, but he got under it and just tapped it down behind square. He's a brilliant player, but the pitch also is very slow. Well, the school kids in the school next door saying, Lara, we love you. Lara walks. It's all over. He's taken the edge. Haddock's got the wicket. Brian Lara is finally out for 375. Court Russell, Bowl Caddick. The players go off the field for lunch. The end of the world record-breaking innings from Brian Lara. 375. It's going to be a long time before anybody gets up to that mark again. The morning has been filled with drama. And Brian Lara slowly leaves the field after his mammoth stay at the crease. He hit six fours today and faced 72 balls and added a further 55 runs. And his colleagues in the West Indies side make the avenue of cricket bats as he walks off the field to be congratulated by everybody that can get near him. A real emotional moment for Brian Lara, the Minister of Sport of Trinidad and Tobago. Jean Peer is there to congratulate him. She's flown over from Trinidad specially this morning. And here with Brian Lara is Charles Colville. Brian Lara, many congratulations. The world record holder, how does it feel? I feel great, I'm really happy. And, uh, it's a special moment for me. It's the best day in my life. And it's nice to have Sir Gary here to see him. Yeah. Must have been a big moment when he came out and shook your hand. I don't know if you saw him, he was out there. Well, I could not see him, you know, I was really under a lot of pressure out there with the crowd and everything. And um, I really appreciate him coming out there and uh, congratulating me. Were they the hardest 46 runs of the innings this morning? Definitely. And just talk us through that moment then when you knew you were level and it was just going to be one shot away. <laughs> well, I thought then that if I'm level with Sir Gary Silver, that's good enough for me. But I think I needed that extra run just to go past and uh, it was good to know that I got there and I just needed one more. At least I levelled the record and, um, and I've been quite happy just to share it with him. Well, you said to me yesterday afternoon, yesterday evening, that you weren't very tired. How are you now? I'm very tired. I got up this morning and I'm feeling very, very tired. But I'm quite happy to, to break the record. If I had to stay out there for another session to do it, I think I would have. Do you think anybody else will ever break your record? 375 is now the target for everyone to go for. Well, the records are made to be broken and um, I could just wish everyone all the best and even myself because I've just started. You're going to have another go at it, are you? <laughs> well, I'm going to start at zero again, but I'm going to try. I think India are next in line then, are they, to feel the weight of your back? Well, I don't know, wait and, and see and um, just hope to have a good county season and hopefully a very good career left. OK, Brian, you've got a nice afternoon out in the field now. Many congratulations and do enjoy yourself. Thanks very much.